Yo! What's up? What is up, everyone? How are y'all doing tonight? See the I got I got some new music. I already switched it up. Um, it's kind of a little preview. I'm I'm doing a whole complete channel look change. Um, I finally decided what I I kind of wanted to do and I'm kind of gonna I'm going for like 80s 80s synthwave retro Blade Runner type shit cyberpunk ish um, so uh, same channel chill hop they have a synthwave channel so I got their music from that and I asked them about it today um, I've been working on the animations for a, a little bit um, and I'm almost done I'm hoping I'll have them completely implemented by next week, 
Yeah, so everything will look different. That's the goal, anyway. Um, but I got a whole retro synthwave 80s like vibe. I'm gonna get some new emotes, like straight like He-Man. I have the power type shit. <laughs> um, it'll be cool. It'll be cool. It'll be cool. Um, I'm excited about it. I, I'm right now. I'm, I'm doing the. The last stage is kind of like where I've made some of the things and I've, I've put them into OBS and they don't quite fit just yet, so I have to like go back and make minor adjustments so that way everything lines up correctly. Uh, but it should be pretty dope. I'm excited about it. I'm excited about it. I posted a little teaser about it on Facebook and Twitter. Plus, who doesn't like the 80s? Who doesn't like the 80s? It was the best time to grow up. It was. It really was. You had the best of both worlds. You lived the, you lived the old life, but you were like... Reading up on the on Titans while they get really deep into their explanation. You have to ask yourself one, one question. question. Do I feel lucky? Well, well do you punk? Well, do you punk? God, if Dirty Harry ever comes on Amazon Prime, we're what we're doing it for a movie night, straight up. Reading up on Titans, uh, what kind of Titans are we talking about? The Titans from Greek mythology, the Titans like Thanos is a Titan, so Titans from Marvel, or Teen Titans from DC Comics. Yeah, yeah, which one? Which 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 Titans? Which Titans are we talking about here? Which Titan? By the way, Sally, hello. Hello. Isn't there two Dirty Harrys? There's four Dirty Harrys. But only the first two movies are named Dirty Harry. The second two movies have different names, but they're still Dirty Harry. So if you ever want to go on a Dirty Harry binge watching, it's a good thing to know. Um, probably, uh, oh, Attack on Titan, dork. Oh, yeah, okay, okay, okay. The, uh, although I think it, it, it's been a while since I've watched the Dirty Harrys. Um, so back when I was in film school, uh, I would take... Every, every semester, I would take a director and I'd watch their entire filmography from beginning to end, every one of the movies that they made in order, and you can see how they grew and how they learned new things as a filmmaker, and I would take notes about that mentally and in my notebooks, whatever, and I would watch that. And so obviously I love Martin Scorsese. Um, but I, I realized very quickly when I was making movies in film school, as much as I wanted to be, I was never going to be a Martin Scorsese. I just didn't make those kind of movies, and I didn't tell those kinds of stories. And it seems a little bit cocky, but one of my famous, or one of my favorite filmographies that I watched was Clint Eastwood's. And I loved his movies. And it was like, yo, those are the kind of stories that I like to tell. So I was like, if, if, if I ever hit that pinnacle, I would want to be like Clint Eastwood. Just saying. Wow, you've really slacked on your film stuff, yeah. You can be putting anything in your mind to. So um, I used to get these books called, uh, they're like something on something, right? So you can read a biography about Clint Eastwood, you can read a biography about whatever director you want. And it's always somebody else's opinion of what they were doing at the time. But there was a series of books, it, it would be like Scorsese on Scorsese, or it would be Eastwood on Eastwood. And they were really cool books, and they had great big pictures, they were really, really big. I have the Eastwood one downstairs. And it was basically somebody sitting down with Clint Eastwood and walking, talking through him, every movie that he's ever made, 
and there's like pictures and he's like recalling like yeah i remember i had to do this um this was a struggle for me when i made that movie this was something creatively we had to overcome blah 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 and it's like their opinion on what they learned and the struggles they went through when they do it and it was so cool because like it's like a, another insight and even with that i found out like so like a lot of people don't know this but like clint eastwood does not hire ever he's worked with the same people for over 45 years same cinematographers same directors same crew members even the the little guys at the bottom of the thing he hires the same people over and over he's like these are my guys they know what i want and they know how to get shit done and that's it he's not about the unions he doesn't give a fuck he hires his people every single time which is why his movies are consistent we have a ton of clint eastwood books i can read yes we do I saw. I, I loved Clint Eastwood. I loved Clint Eastwood. So I, I have a lot of Clint Eastwood books. <laughs> my, uh, my. I have a biography on him called The American Rebel, and uh, it's pretty cool. And it, like a lot of people didn't know how Clint Eastwood got into the film business, is uh, he was a, uh, he was a United States Marine, and a lot of people didn't know that. And his job in the Marines, like he wasn't a combat MOS or anything like that. But his job was like when they would sit everybody down for training he would have to make and show the training videos to everyone and he well, was pitter like, patter let's get at her all right all right well fucking just keep me talking about clint eastwood and then tell me you're done listening <laughs> <laughs> all right let's get to this game all right so I got onto a point in this game. So after last time, right? Um, I got the boat, and I went around everywhere I could possibly go, and try to catch everything that I possibly can. So I, I started catching. I caught everything that I can possibly get at this point. I think. But there's this one, and I'm gonna show you this this little fucker right here. See him up there? This little guy right here was so impossible to catch. I looked him up. Apparently he has like a, a you have like a two percent chance to catch this guy. But every time I didn't catch him. This happened. What can I say? It's a gift. Look how much fucking XP you get. It's insane. So by the time I finally caught one, look how fucking leveled up I am. It's ridiculous. I literally gained like 25 levels. Griffin learned wind tunnel. Oh no! Please choose a chick to be replaced. Oh, so oh, see, I didn't know that. They have to. They can only learn so many. Let's get rid of that. Slice and dice. So yeah, this this fucking guy right here, impossible to catch, but when you get him, a lot of XP. A lot of XP. So obviously, I did all the side questing. I did all the fucking the hunts and caught one of everything I've encountered up to this point. So now, time to continue the story.
And then, you know what? It took me two days to catch him. Two days of playing. That's why I have so many fucking levels, because of this fucking guy. Now, I did accidentally go over here before, and the story started, and I tur immediately turned the game off. So that's why I was like, oh, okay, I, I can't go in this general direction. So... But I got a fucking boat! I'm on a boat and it's going fast, man. Shoo! I'm drifting. I'm drifting in this boat. Shoo! Alright. So this happened last time and I was like, oh fuck. I wasn't supposed to go over here yet. And so I turned it off, so that way I didn't miss any cutscenes on stream. There she blows! Autumnia! It won't be long till we meet the next great sage, huh? <laughs> I fear not, boy. Though you have come a long way. <laughs> Fucking Shadar! Come then! Show me your power! <laughs> Who the hell is that? It's... The Dark Jin himself! Shadar! <laughs> I'm so overleveled. I'm gonna fucking spank this guy. <laughs> the savior at long last. I'm so overleveled. I'm gonna fucking spank this dude. Look at how much damage that fucking Griffin is doing. And which sucks because, like, look, he's still doing legitimate damage to me. Even at this level that I'm at, like... I, I imagine this would have been pretty hard if I not went off and caught everything. Let's go! I know, I imagine, imagine if I didn't go get all those levels from catching shit, he actually probably would have killed me a lot. Yeah. <laughs> so, this is the extent of your power. Shadar, where is she? The extent where of my Alicia? power? Dude, I got Alicia, half your health down and you just quit. a name I have not heard in a long time. You may be fated to avert this world's doom, but first, you will have to save Yourself. <laughs> Shadar! Ah! Oh, well. What the flipping heck is that big eye? It's looking this way. I'll tell you what it is. It's something stolen from Final it's Fantasy IX. And then the whole concept's stolen from Pokemon. Is this big? Is there anything original in this game? Say <laughs> Yeah, this whole cutscene is ripped from Final Fantasy IX. Yikes. I bet we end up on an island. Huh? I'm back in. Oliver! Oliver! It's her. This way! Come this way! Come on, Oliver! Uh, okay. Jeepers! Whoa! Oh. Oliver! Look both ways! Huh? Oh, sorry. Look both I ways! Somewhere else. <laughs> it's alright now. Huh? What's alright now? The big bad eye. It's gone now. The big bad eye? Of course! Uh, I've never you seen had it. the storm. So, I, I swear to God, if what I end I up doing? on an island with a broken ship, but should and I, the only thing to friends. do is to go find a Your secret friends? town, Full of They're magic people. There, this huh? is straight up ripped from this Final way, Fantasy Oliver? IX. Let P show you the way. But 
hey, so far, Hurry up, slow coach. it's ripped from Final Fantasy IX. It's like the beginning of Disc 2 on Final Fantasy IX. Oliver, oh, thank goodness. Everybody's here, but where's P? They don't know who P is, bro. What's he on about? Oi! Oh, you back with us at last, Captain. It looks like it's more than a gust of wind to keep you down. Anyway, enough of this soppy stuff, Captain. There's a ship fake to sail. Oh, look at that. The ship is fucking broken. Do you think it was P? Anyway, it doesn't matter. I couldn't beat Shazar. We could have beat him. He just ran away. Like a little bitch. Like a little bitch. Has anybody seen Mr. Drippy now that you mention it? No, I don't think he's he's washed away. No. There he is. Are you okay? What? What's that? What do you mean? I'm fine. Of course I am. Did you hit your head when you washed the shore or something? You're acting like a right weirdo. What do you want about mom? Is the boat fixed? Uh, this is some we need to get uh draw my dreams to uh read Drippy's um uh, dialogue. Uh why would you want to do that? Boring it is deserted. I shouldn't wonder and dangerous too, perilous even. Let's just say enjoy, shall we? Uh, there's a beautiful yeah, nice. Okay, whatever. So he doesn't want to be here. Wait, man, you can't, man. Didn't you hear me? It's dangerous. You'll be eaten, flipping alive. Look, fairy, I'm not mad key myself, but we haven't had much of a choice. We'll just have to grin and bear it, okay? Yo, by the way, this guy Swain looks stoned out of his mind all the time. <laughs> like, fucking ripped. <laughs> Loading, loading. Oh, look at that. We're on a... Stranded on an island. I don't know what that thing is over there, but that looks like a fucking magic town. This is straight ripped from Final Fantasy IX. All Out is a good way to change your tactics. Uh, okay, cool. All out, oh, 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 all out, so I do get that all out defense I was reading about, because I'm trying to figure out how to make people tank. What's that? That's one I've never seen before. What's that? Is that something new? It's something new! Watch this. Come here, Sprog Gog. Time for you to get caught, bud. Oh, no, no. And I got him in one shot. Fuck yeah. That was the only time I've ever got it in one shot. The only time. Keep the sprog cog, yeah. Cogo. Sprog cog, what are you? Oh, you have like no abilities. Huh. Two wet stones. Right, how do we get up here? It's quite obvious that wherever that is is where we need to go. It's over here. Rings a bell. Can you go 
in this cave? Well, you can't go in this cave. Let's talk to the crabs. Talk to all of them or just the one? So, what do they do? Do they just kind of give me tips and tricks? They just give like hints and shit. I am still liking the game. I, I love old school RPGs. I do. I really, really do. Even though it is a blatant ripoff of Pokemon and Final Fantasy IX at this point. Yeah, so you just talk to crabs and shit in here. Alright, let's leave. There's nothing for us in here! Okay, I don't think we can go that away. I'm so over leveled. Well, 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 well. Oh, Nickers, this won't be pretty. What's what? Well, if it ain't my little drippy, where have you been then? Off gallivanting, I bet, without a word to your old man the whole time. You've been the death of me, if you will. Mr. Jippy, I think he's talking to you. Can't be, man. I have no idea who she is. Oh, there's cruel. Why don't you back in? Why are you back anyway, Jippy? Find that human you were looking for? Did you suppose to be some sage or something, wasn't it? Ah, this is the fairy town. Bet it. But look at the state I'm in. I've just woken up, man. Why, mon? Why didn't you tell me we had visitors, Jippy boy? Come on, Ollie boy. Type right here in the corner. I've marked it for you, and that's where I am. Come see me. Come and see me, all right? Uh 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 uh. A village all the way out here? Oh, this looks just like the Black Mage village from Final Fantasy IX. <laughs> Look at that. Uh, is that supposed to be an octopus or something? Knickers, now I'm flipping for it. Oh, look at all these things. Do I catch all of them? Look, mon, humans. Where to, mon? Crikey, it is. And all flipping humans, mon. Sally Quinn, Regime Hydrate. Um, I don't have any water. <laughs> the octopus in a tree. I will have to go. Get some water. I'll be right back, guys. Enjoy the new music. Tell me, it's popping. It's popping. And. Music's not working. There she goes.
Ladies and gents, we're back. How do you guys feel about the new synth, synthwave music? I think it's cool. This is me personally. Sally, here's your hydrate. And don't feel bad. I needed more alcohol and I needed to pee, so did it all at once. Proper weird looking, ain't they? And I thought the one drippy was, was bad enough. Look at them all. <laughs> Are they all fairies too? Flippin' heck, man. It's, it's only flippy drippy boy. Flippy, what? You're right, man. Drippy man. What are you going back by there? This is so confusing, this dialogue. Welcome to the fairy ground, forest of the fey folk and land of my fathers. Well, mothers, really, but... No way. A totally tidy town. Right, old boys, just drop by to say hello, isn't it? And that's done now, so tidy, catch you next time. Nah, man, you can't go just like that. What are you on about, man? You've only just got home. You haven't even seen ma'am yet. Ooh. There's only be a serious layoff. Stop it, you lot. Ali boy, help! Nickers, help! So what's been making him behave so strangely? I'm guessing we're gonna find out he's not actually the king of fairies like he claims to be. Let's go get him! Okay, I'm in. I wouldn't miss a chance to see the Lord High Lord of Big Mouth squirm if you paid me. <laughs> look at him! Look at Swain! Look at- doesn't he look high as fuck? Dude, he looks so toasted. But we're not open yet. Okay. This is, I like to keep my reserves. Uh... My reserves a little clean. What is this? No new bounty hunts? Okay. I got so much fucking money though, so... What is this? Lips curses? We don't have one. Let's buy it. We don't have one of these either. Let's buy it. He always looked like that meanie. Yeah, it doesn't seem like he's a... Uh, he's very loved around here. A hundred gold. Oh, look, there's another treasure chest. Oh, what happened? That voice, is that... Well, I guess Don't I couldn't you grab that treasure chest. What the fuck do you on about? Shut up about it, will you? Went round with you on your travel, she did. What happened to her, lovely girl? You started with a P. Named with something like, um, oh, hippopotamus. Give up, will you? Honest to goodness. Ah, no, I remember. Oh, the whole mountain is a fucking Alicia, thing. That was it. Blame me. <sighs> My goodness, she's enormous. Yes, yeah, she is. So this is Drippy's mom. While she certainly makes a big first impression, I'll give her that. 
Lovely girl she was. Where is she? Abe probably just left her somewhere, didn't you? There's terrible. And to think you're a son of mine. It's his mama. It's his mama. Well, just look at your nose, mom. You should turn that thing off once in a while. You little waste. <laughs> Cost you a fortune, it will. <laughs> I don't charge myself for using it, do I? Flip, mom. <laughs> It's kind of you. And suddenly she's listening. Are you delivering, trying to wind me up or something? Honestly. Oh, there's lovely. What's it about now? You're looking very slim these days, love. God, she's huge. She is. Yes, she is. Little Lord Lard, I used to call you. <laughs> Sounds like a mean grandma. <laughs> my grandma used to say that to my my little brother. She always used to be like, David, I like you because you got spunk. She looked at my brother, but Michael, you're just fat. My grandma was such a mean lady. <laughs> Who's this then, eh? Oh, we're going with my drippy, is it? Now, which one of you is the pure hearted one? Oh, pure. It's pure hearted, man. Pure. I'm flipping pure hearted one. Pure. God, it's so hard to read. Nice to meet you, ma'am. Are you Miss Mr. Drippy's mother? That's right, my lovely, for my sins. Aw, oh, isn't he just adorable? Oh, while I remember, you keep familiar, isn't it, love? I've got a sweet, few sweeties by here somewhere. Let's see now. Oh, there we are. Oh, is she going to give me, uh... Nothing I don't already have a thousand of, so it's cool. Out of the blue, but you wouldn't mind taking a look at my guts, would you? What? You don't get much more out of the blue than that. <laughs> you want to take a look at my guts? I can't turn it off. It's none of your business what I do with it anyway. I'm a grown-ass fairy. Alright. I'm going to skip some dialogue. Uh, you should have come popping out a while back, but nothing got a peep. Desperate I am. Okay, so it's like this. My mom brings up all the fairies. There's baby fairies to you inside her tummy, okay? And once they're big enough, they pop. But it's so warm and comfy in there that sometimes the darlings don't want to come out. I heard some strange things in my times, but... Wait, is she asking us to go up in her JJ? She's asking us to go up inside her vajayjay and see why the babies aren't coming out. I don't know about this. We're gonna get canceled for this. So in order to make her squeeze them out, we have to make her laugh. So we have to go get somebody from the comedy club. Okay. Hey handsome, are you exercised? Cause you're something I should be doing right now, but I'm not. <laughs> Show <Draw> my dreams. <laughs> How are you, mate? Oh man. I 
Hammer, right? How about you? That's what you're, that's what you're supposed to say. No, I'm just kidding. So we're back playing this, this, this game again. Now I can finally get my fucking treasure chest. Alright, alright. What about this weapon shop? Are you open up yet? Ooh. Yeah, equip that shit. That's good. Uh, I'm doing good. Getting a late night snack before getting stuck into the Last of Us for a few hours. Ooh. Which one? Last of Us 1 or 2? They're both fantastic. So. Um. They are both fantastic. Oh, look at all this fucking stuff we can get. Thank God I got all this fucking money, right? The controversial one? Which one? The second one? The second one wasn't really... I mean, yeah, I guess so. I guess so. Let's buy one of those. Oh, look at this. Yeah, 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 yeah. Equip, equip, equip. Let's buy an extra. It's a good measure. And voice actors to get death threats. Oh, Last of Us 2? Last of Us 2? <laughs> because people fucking hated Abby so much. People hated Abby so much. I don't have one of those yet. Let's, um... We need to buy another Seabreeze cloak. Joel had it coming, yeah. He did. He was not... I mean, he was a good guy, but... You know, he... He kind of did some shit, you know? But Joel was a really good character. He really was, though. But, I mean, to me, it just, it just, it just made sense that at some point... If Ellie's all grown up, it's not gonna be about Joel anymore. You know? Are you excited for the, uh... The Last of Us TV show. They've casted uh. Hurry up, man! They're on already. Mando. Look at that. They have a little stage and everything. Take that. Thank you and good night. They casted uh, Pedro Rubbish Pascal as uh, Joel. How long is this going to go on for? This is embarrassing. Hi, Sally. So we're supposed to get to this uh, comedy club and get these guys to make a joke. But apparently they're not good at comedy. At all. And yeah, I love Joel too. I'm all for good hairy dad game. But I completely sympathize with Abby. And yeah, I'm hyped for with that show. Yeah, I completely sympathize with Abby too. 
And Abby wasn't a bad person. And I think that's what's great about Last of Us. Like, nobody was really a bad person. They were just doing what they had to do to survive. And it conflicted with other people, you know? Like, if anything, Abby let Ellie live, like, what? Never mind. I'm not going to say anything. Because I don't know how far in the game you are. I'm done talking about it. I don't want to ruin anything for you. It's fantastic. I hope you enjoy the game. I did get the Platinum Trophy for uh, Last of Us 2. Sally bought it for me, actually. When it came out. She got me Last of Us. Um... Alright. I, I'm, I'm very, very, I'm reading very, very fast. Okay, I need to cure people that are heartbroken. But I saw another chest over here somewhere. Yep. Is this game getting daunting, or is that just me? Well, what do you mean by daunting, Sally? It is a very massive game. Old old school RPGs are are huge games, and they are games that you can sink hundreds of hours of your life into, just because that's how they made them. There was so much content back then, so much things to do. I I've played through it all already. Like, they could have handled Abby's story elements a little bit better. The whole thing with the kids was a bit all over the place. Yep. Agreed. But I thought that it was a great way to show no matter how good you think the characters are, every person has to that. Yep, exactly. Same thing over and over and over again. Yeah. I'm sure I'm going to learn something new from doing all this nonsense. I don't know why my map went away. There we go. None of that shit is working. think with them things they they read around the sky on yikes so I don't know which spell I'm supposed to put everybody needs a different spell that it doesn't seem like that I have This is like the little, no interesting, intriguing story you want to read. No, this is like the filler content, and I'm just like, ah. See, look, I got what I needed. There we go. Nice. Alright. What does this guy want?
A sausage and custard omelet. That does sound interesting. There we go. I obtained some courage. How's it been? Uh, I've been feeling the cold so bad lately. I've not had a chance, but shiver. It's been. Um, fireball. I do have all the spells. I just gotta think this through. There we go. What about this guy up here? What do, what do you what do you need? Nature's tongue. This the Nino Kuli equivalent of go clear this dungeon of Draugr going down smoothly. I guess so. <laughs> I haven't been to a single dungeon yet. Well, no, no, no. Oh, I got a levitate spell. <laughs> um, actually, there was that one dungeon in the very beginning of the game. But there hasn't been any dungeons yet that I've had to do. I think I'm fucking knocking them out of the park. Like, they're like, what do you need? And I'm like, ah, oh, rah, 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 you know? If you got any piece of art, it looks like your type of might have. I've just broken this giant jar, see? Um, who could be so clumsy? Uh, okay, 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 okay. So... Rejuvenate. Boom! The Chinese game based on Sun Wukong? No, uh... Is that the one where you fight and you get older and stuff every time you die? Because that I've seen the trailer for that one and it looks interesting. We're just getting all these pieces of art. Take heart. We're gonna take some of his restraint. No, you play as the Monkey King, the guy. Every anime protagonist. Oh, the Monkey King game. That game, the one that came out like maybe eight months, eight months ago. If so, I've seen, I've seen stuff for that one. All right, so I need to make the floor sweep. Oh, here we go. Broom, broom. I didn't even know that was a spell that I had. That's almost everybody. We have one left. What what did you want me to do? 
Okay. I don't know. I'm just gonna try all of them. That's all my spells. So what he needs to do is make that flower pressing stone of his a heck of a lot heavier. I don't have anything that adds weight. Oh, there we go. Alright, John my James, let me pull this up. Let's do this, guys. Hold on. Let's go do this. We're gonna, um... Yeah, 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 yeah. How do I, how do you do the ad browser source? Is it display capture? No, it's not display capture. Window capture. Okay. Oh, jeez. Which window is it? Which window is it? There's so many fucking windows open. Alright, well, I can't figure out how to open it, so... <laughs> Discard! Discard! Oh, did I completely fuck up the stream? I did. What the hell are we... I have no idea what we're looking at. <laughs> Don't know. Yeah, delete that. Ah, look at that. Oh, the infinite corridor! <laughs> Whatever, I'm watching. I'm watching. I was trying to pull it up so we can watch it together. I don't know how to do that. Well, pitter patter, let's get at her. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. This legitimately looks good.
Hey, Gene Art. Yeah, they didn't they didn't show you riding a cloud in the trailer, but it looks good. Like it looks like it looks like it's gonna be like Dark Souls hard. Hi, Gene Art, how are you? It looks like it's um It definitely looks like it's gonna be like Dark Souls kind of uh like difficulty slash combat. Um but the graphics like in it looks legit and it's like kung fu too, that's fucking dope. Um, no, that looks like fucking fire. That looks like fire. Um, hold on. Alright, I'm gonna be here. I gotta pee again, guys. I'm sorry. I have the weakest fucking bladder ever. Be right back. That new synth wave music kick in? It did. What? I'm gonna switch to the just chatting room so I can bump to this real quick. Ha! <laughs> art that drove me crazy. Uh-oh, what was it? I've just been, uh... Sorry, I'm gonna turn this down. I've been working on some animations. I'm, I'm gonna redo my whole channel look to be, uh, 80s retro kind of like cyberpunk feel. Um, and I've been, I'm finishing up animations now. And so this is kind of like the background music that I got. Um, from Chill Hop. But they have like a synthwave channel, so. It's going to be fucking deep. It's going to be deep. So what were you making, Gene Art? Can you show us this piece of art? Is there a link that you can drop that we can look at? I'm not gonna lie, I don't know how to bring it up on stream. So there is that. I haven't quite figured out how to do shit yet. <laughs> anyway, while we're on a break, let's go ahead and, uh, let's go ahead and shut some people out. You just kinda have to stay out of the water. No, shit. No. There we go. Yo, this is the definition of synthwave music. Do you want to fucking go, Sally? Because I fucking go there. <laughs> what the dude so I fucking fight you. <laughs> <laughs> Gets me every time. You wanna have a fucking go? Put the dukes up and fight you. Oh man. Gina, do you not have a clip? No! Speaking of which, we are collecting pieces of art for this game. 
didn't realize Sally was a furry. <laughs> I, that was that was before I knew her, um, and she apparently was streaming uh, Sonic the Hedgehog in her cosplay as Sonic. But I don't really know. I, I'm not the authority on that. I would ask her. She would know better than I. But I'm pretty sure that that's right. We got them pieces of art for you. All right. Let's look at this up. Ooh. Nice, Jean Art. Sally, come look at this. I know you're in the other room. Now, is this... Forgive me, Gina, is this an original piece or is this based off of... Well, I mean, it's, it's clearly an original piece. But, uh... Is it is it based off of a fandom or is this something you came up with yourself? I don't know a lot of fandoms other than the things that I'm going to I do like the, um... You talking about me in here? I am talking about you in here. What are you talking about? Well, one, Draw My Dreams was asking if you were a furry because when you were shout out, you were in your Sonic cosplay. And I, I, I was like, I'm pretty sure that's a Sonic cosplay. And then two, Gene Art just uh, gave us a link to a piece of art that he finished. See? I apologize. Um, and I was like, oh, so you want to have a come look at uh, some of the thing? Oh, I'll go, I'll go look at all my other Okay. I don't really know what I'm talking about. I don't know what I'm I do not need anything. I am all set. Thank you very much. Anyway, what I was just saying, I do like this, this red circle... I feel like, okay, so, is, if this is, if I'm being interpretive, I feel like it's a dragon egg. I'm not an artist, Gene Art, so forget me. I like it, though. Um, no, I like it. Why did this frustrate you? Can you tell us why it frustrated you? And I, I can't show it on stream. I don't know how to do all that. See, there you go, Sally. I like it. See, I understand. <laughs> See, Sally knows more about these things than I do. When she's like, she paints something and she asks me about it. And I'm like, oh, that's great. I love it. And I really do love it. But I don't know anything about art, so I don't know what to say. Like, I love your brush strokes here. I don't know what to say. I don't. Anyway, we have pieces of art that we were collecting in Nino Kune. So, we're going to give them to them, and apparently it's going to <coughs> inspire them to be better comedians. Oh, it was a late bloomer. Flip mod. The comic music is in the house, and we're about to bring down, bring her down around your flipping ears, mod. Proper. See, I know, amazing, isn't it? That's the power of pieces of art, man. Proper miraculous they are. I guess we just talked to him again. Oh yeah, yeah. So this, this, this fucking, this um, Queen of the Fairies lady basically just asked us. 
to climb up inside of her for JJ and see why the babies aren't coming out. It's like a dream, this is. Hey, Hey, speaking of dreams, I've always had a bit of a dream myself, you know. Oh, nice. Nice link, man. What it is, is, see, always want to run a little weapon shop, I have. A weapon shop, eh? Well, I don't know why you're bringing it up in the middle of a show, but sounds like an all right idea, that does. Ain't it, though? Hey, do you fancy doing a quick practice with me? Huh? Practice? Yeah, man. I'll be the shopkeeper, see? And you, um, a zookeeper, right? And, uh, but all your animals have run away and your wife's left you. Oh, yeah. Make it easy for me, why don't you? I'm not a flipping professional actor, am I, you diff? Come on, man, <laughs> serious now. What do you want me to be? Uh, Jesus, what a fucking lynch is nice. Is that any flipping easy, yeah? Can I just be my flipping self? Oh, and these Welsh we'll accents are on point. All right, no, no, good to know. You trying to give me something hard to do so you look better in here, though? Nah, man. I just thought you'd like a nice juicy roll to get your teeth into, ain't it, though? Juicy roll, huh? Well, I may not be a professional, but my widow Twanky's pretty legendary. Right on. So, I'm the customer at your weapon shop, right? And you were the proprietor of said establishment. All right, give us a moment. Ba 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 ma 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 ka 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 ka. Get on with it, man. And knock knock out, do cha ching. Clear off, cha ching. What the heck was that, man? We slam the door in my flipping face. We're not open yet, are we? Not open yet, but flipping are you, Bill? All right, we're open now. Oh, you are right. This is a pretty sad comedy show. How do? How do? I uh just wanted to look at what weapons you got here, innit? Sorry, man, that's next door but one. What? No, it's flipping not. It's my shop. Yeah, you were weapon shop. You can't go telling me what I sell to my own shop. But you said yourself you wanted it to be a flipping weapon shop. It is a flipping weapon shop. Give me strength, man. All right, all right. Sorry, man. I'll do it properly now, I promise. It's a weapon shop. Good. Selling weapons. Exactly. Right oh. Knock, knock. Cha-ching, how do? What weapons you got for here then? What weapons you after exactly? Speaking of whales, well, I don't know, do have I? you heard of the comedy um, group Dirty about, Sanchez? You know, I have not. Choppy numbers. Yeah, a proper massive one of them. That's what he wants. Uh, I'm afraid I cannot help you. Huh? You can't help me. You're the flipping. I tell you, who I really like is uh, I, sorry, I really sir, like a. Huh? But that is just too big an axe. Flipping axe. <laughs> I guess we got the old lady laughing. I really like, uh, I, I'm probably gonna get some flat. I love Jim Jeffries. I do. I love Jim Jeffries. I listen to his podcast every week. Man, and our, our comedy club up here just recently reopened again, and I think, uh, there's somebody coming here in a few weeks that I would love to go see but I don't I, I just don't know how I feel about it with the whole we're being in Missouri and no protections against COVID and shit so uh, Jeremy Piven Jeremy uh, uh, Jeremy Piven's coming to our comedy club here soon and uh, uh, Jeremy Piven he's from Entourage he's uh, Ari, Ari Gold I think that's what he's most famously known for and I've been checking out his podcast lately too where he's like it's called like Piven How You Living or something, um, and it, 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 I'm only two episodes in, and so far I'm I'm still kind of mediocre on it. But he's kind of just talking about how he knows everyone in Hollywood, and I'm like, I mean that's basic what Entourage was about. So um, they're a Welsh jackass ripoff, but they are fucking insane. Some of their stunts included eating a still beating snake heart. Ew! That poor fucking snake. Drinking freshly liposuction fat from a shot glass. <laughs> no. <laughs> and chopping off the tip of one of their fingers with a fucking cigar. What? Why? Why though? That's just fucking ridiculous. She's laughing like a flipping drain, tidy. Drippy man, we're all set. Right, do you lot all aboard? 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 Yeah. Ah, 
Oh, we're about to go into her. Let the mission to mom begin. We're going into her for JJ. Hey, one of you give us a light, will you, man? Launch command received. Roger, Roger that. that. Did it for the Vine, my guy. Oh, dude, I remember Vine. Vine was like the original TikTok. Three, two, one, blast So I think we're going into her mouth, but she told us to check on her baby maker. So it's too good. I was trying to figure out what Mr. Drippy was this whole time. And a lot of the rest of them are like I think so. You think they're are they all Welsh? All right, no need to get in a tiz. It's the only way to get in here, isn't it? Oh, this takes me back. Look around you, my friends. This year's mummy's tummy where it all started. We are literally in her baby maker. <laughs> I can't wait to see what they look like inside. Oh, God. No, the kids are American. That guy just sounds British. Yeah, the, the little kid, he's hes British of some sort. I'm not sure about the girl. And then he's some weird thing, too. I don't know. None of them are American. None of them sound American to me. Okay, we're in a weird fucking level now. Here we are, the tulip room. All right. The violet room. All right. The daffodil room. All right, we're in some weird ass shit. What do you think? Okay, okay. We can't go there. Got the final sign of that bondage drawing earlier today, too. One less thing to worry about. There you go. Yeah. So, I still haven't, um... I had a, uh, big job interview last week. I still haven't heard back from it. And I'm kind of worried about it. It's, it's, to be fair... It's not a big deal if I don't get it. It really isn't. But if I do get it, this is kind of one of those, uh, li uh well, I don't want to say life-changing opportunities, but it could be. Mr. Jippy, look, oh, Knickers, if we don't do something quick, that Rodder's going to make himself a little omelet. We'll have to save him. Oh, wait, 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 whoa, 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 whoa. So th are these certain familiars that I can only catch while I'm in here with JJ? Uh, well, I'll cross all the fingers for you, man. I'm with the job. <clears throat> it's a, it's a very large advertising agency, and I would be in charge of advertising. For everyone. So... It's so, it's a, the, the, the official title is paid advertising manager, but it would basically be paid advertising director type thing. So I'd be in charge of all, all advertising for an, an advertising agency, so.
Oh well. That ended quickly. That's probably because I'm fucking over leveled. <laughs> oh, that's fucking sweet, you'll do great. And if not, fuck them. They don't know what they're missing. Plenty of other jobs. There is, there's, there's a lot of jobs right now. The job market is, uh. is crazy right now. A lot of people are hiring and they can't find people. And I'm, I'm, I'm pretty happy with where I'm at now, but, well, I'm not gonna lie, I'm stressed the fuck out all the time where I'm at now, but, when, when a big company like that wants to talk to you, you don't not answer the phone, you know what I'm saying, and you're like, oh, wait, alright, that's not a position you just kind of say, no, I'm good, you know, it doesn't matter how they get in, what matters is how they're saving the littles. So, there's some fucking things in here trying to eat her eggs. Don't be scared, you'll be fine! Am I gonna get scored on how many of these things I save? Yep. That's the worst case. <laughs> That's the. We need to go to the Rose Room next. Uh, so we got all these baddies in here. Well, I've already caught all those. Go! I hate how, like, they get in each other's way and they won't attack. Nice work. Yeah, I'm incredibly overleveled. The tulip room. I oh, look at the little eggs hopping. <laughs> This is definitely a unique, uh, oh, it's a, it's a Ray Ray. Oh, uh, who Ray? This thing took me a while to catch, too, by the way. Watch this! My attack's so high, it's like I don't see the point in using magic. Looks like the daffodil rooms become unlocked. It's the violet room. Look at all the little fucking eggs behind us. Ooh, I haven't seen one of those before. A plessy? Ooh, he looks cool. Let's try. Come on, 100%, let's catch one! Let's catch one! It's all RNG though, so I can't control whether I catch one or not. Yep, we didn't get one. What can I say? It's a gift. What is these? Angerina! So we are playing Nino Kune tonight, and from what I've learned so far, it is a is a is a rip off, rip off between Pokemon and Final Fantasy IX, and I'm walking around inside someone's baby maker, a very big baby maker. <laughs> what the fuck is that thing? I want to catch it! A hover blubber. 
Come on, no, of course you, you weren't going to catch it. Nito! I'm sure it's not the only opportunity to catch it. Looks like the creepy demons from Berserk. Yeah. It does though, it does though, it does though. All here, all here. One, two, three, four, four, all blah, blah, blah. Yeah, there's there's too many of them. Did they ever shut up? They're so annoying. How do we get rid of them? <laughs> oh, dear. Lord. Well, I mean, if it's a baby maker, then it should have baby things. Yeah, the little eggs. So there's this, Andrea, there's this big fairy lady. She's the size of a mountain. And basically, she asked us, um, my babies aren't coming out. Can you go inside and check check out why? So we had to make her laugh to open her up. And then while she was laughing, we had to sh shoot inside of her and see why the babies aren't coming out, which is what these eggs are. So we're technically in her baby maker right now. It's, um, who is this guy? You're on your break. You're supposed to be fucking watching these kids. Shout out of a big black cannon, too. <laughs> <laughs> Yep. <laughs> Alright, hold on. It's telling me to go that way, which goes down. And I don't think I'm going to go be, be able to get back up. So the completionist in me is like, what's up these stairs? If you want to go out the back end of her guts, that's what he just told me. <laughs> it's just an emergency exit out of her guts. Oh, dear lord. Oh, boy. Alright, let's, 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 uh... Take a ride on the tidy slidey. Right Let's on. do it. Come on, Lippies. It's time for the slidey ride of you with tiny, tiny lives. It's a cute nursery, not gonna lie. Well, don't just stand there. Come on. Huh? <laughs> <sighs> 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 what the? What is that thing? Oh, that is a boss. That's what that is. Nickers! That rotter of a squid's got our kids. What the heck? The Littlies! No way! We already saved them once. Sorry, Ollie boy, but the future of the fairy race is at stake. Ah, do we have any choice? We're so over-leveled, it's not... It doesn't even fucking matter. Just hit the fucking attack button. Get out of here, dude. Oh shit, you confused me. Yo, even over leveled? Like, look how long it's taking me to, uh. The end game for this must be actually ridiculously hard. This 
fairy is kicky as fuck. Why is there a ten of giant inside her vagina? <laughs> what the flippin' heck, there's loads of little things coming out of it, man. My knee looks proper knackered after popping that lot out. Now is a chance to give it a smack or two, Ollie boy. No, I wanted to go... Get him! Get rid of all these fucking... All these little ads. Girl. Boom! Boss down! Nice work! How do I delete that? What did you say, Angelina? You asked for it. <laughs> I read it, naughty girl. There's a scene in Sword Online, Art Online, season one you'd like. Is it least season one? There's a, I think there's a scene in every season with tentacle porn. I'm just saying. Oh no, I've seen it all. What did she say? I missed it. Sally got it. She said, no, I'm not gonna. Say. They're getting crazy in the newest seasons. Lots of sexual rape and killing. Okay, so I wanted to share with y'all that I got the job. I start tomorrow. Yeah! Congratulations, Angelina. It, it draw my dreams. It was something about tentacles in her JJ. Come on, ta 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 ta, whatever the fuck that means, thank goodness. Uh, someone had to make sure the babies made it out. We pop out along with the liddies. Okay, so we're, now we're gonna like legitimately travel through the JJ. Okay. This is getting weirder by the minute, guys. And now it's recorded on your stream. Oh my god, dear lord. Sorry, this is Cray Cray. Sally, that's for you. Oh. They come in. Oh, I can feel it. Oh, they come in. At long last. Come on, my little darlings. So we just So hold on, did she just Did she just ejaculate and shoot us all out? Jesus Christ, Japan is the whole needs to go to therapy. I think we just got ejaculated. 
Uh, I think that's what just happened. You boys did a proper tidy job. Mom was laughing fit to a flipping burst. Um, he's, he's making friends. Oh my god. I can't believe... Like, it's not obvious if you were a kid playing this game. But as an adult, you kind of know what just happened. And you're like, hold on. That doesn't sound right. Something, something just happened. It's because they're all busy working and studying all their sexual frustration is shown through anime. Look, I like anime, Andrea. I do. I like a lot of anime. But I'm not gonna lie, they do they do over sexualize a lot in anime. Oh, Oliver. What's wrong? It's Philip. He's mean. Oh, dear. It's a birth I know about it so much. Oh, Yolly boy. Don't cry, man. I'm the tear fairy, see? I don't like seeing them go to waste. You're a... a fairy? I am, and a proper tidy one at that. You talk funny. So his stuffed animal. <laughs> That's how fairies talk, sweetie. Draw my dreams, Angelina, that missed it. But it's goofy. His oh, little stuffed animal well, I turned I'd known that into I him for you. Mr. Dipper. Nobody made him. He's my friend. After his mom, of his mom passed I'm away. Sorry. And I'm sure he'll always be your friend, no matter what. Come on now, don't be such a crybaby bunting. What would Mr. Drippy think? I'm not a crybaby bunting. Then you'd better dry those tears, hadn't you? Hmm? Oh, so she ate the fucking squid and it didn't go in the place she thought it was going to go. Take much convincing to you. Do you want to disappoint her? No, I can't. What do you mean, right? Oh, how many times? Blah, blah, blah. They're going to go do some scouting for us. We got a shift shape spell. A second self spell. The mimic spell. The Vanish spell. The Werecat spell. We get a lot of... Woo! The Werefish spell. We're getting a lot of fucking spells from this girl. The Shrink spell. The Open Mind... Holy shit. Holy shit! The Loaf of Life spell. The Poison Apple. We just got like ten fucking new spells. Like... Drippy left me. Is he not going on our journey anymore? We just... We're done with him. Is that it? He, he's just done.
Family's family, I suppose. This is where you need to be. Shall we go? Uh, they're gonna want me to string, sneak off without them. Yeah, they're telling me to sneak off without them. Alright, guys. I need another drink. And I'm gonna pee again. Because I have a tiny bladder. Enjoy the new synth wave sounds. Hopefully by Monday. I will have everything fi finished. And we will have a completely new 80's retro channel look. We will find out. We will find out. Oi, oi. Guys, I swear to God, I have I have the weakest bladder. I, I need I can't go 45 minutes without having to take a piss. It's uh it's a little ridiculous. What am I doing my headphones? Got our new synth wave sounds. Hey. Yeah, so I'm gonna have a whole, whole. Like synth wave 80s retro type theme to the channel coming here real soon. I'm, I've am i been working on it for a little bit. Um, I'm a couple hours a day when I have time. And I'm hoping to finish it real soon. So I'm hoping by Monday it'll be live. So come Monday's stream, everything will be completely new. 
because all this stuff I have now, I kind of threw up in a in a hurry once I got OBS, and I was, and I, I've the longest part was deciding on a channel theme to go with. The boat is fixed, Idaho climber. Hey hey hey. How are you? We did the right thing, didn't we? You still got about the three of it. I can't believe we fucking left him behind. Y'all are some fucking... Oi! Did you hear that? Yeah. You're okay. Just okay. Just okay. Oh! Hey, Gene Art. Drippy! Are you forgetting someone? Your family calls you for one hour on the phone. It's been a rough week at work. I, I know I don't have. I understand. I completely, completely, completely understand. But you and me, of course I want to stay with them, but you and me have been a team since you were a little one, or a litly, and I was just a doll, isn't it, Ollie boy? I've been by your side through the thick and thin, remember what you said, and I was, you said I was your friend. Yeah, because he was his little stuffed animal when he was a little boy. I actually hit the vape at work today. I have to do it all the time, all the time. I have to step outside and just take like a puff or two and just do it. I, for me, I don't know whether it's like stress or um, nicotine addiction. Thing is, I don't vape. Oh, you don't vape. Oh. That's definitely stress then. It's definitely stress then. I used to smoke. So I used to smoke like two packs of cigarettes a day. Uh, I switched to vape, and I started at like 16% nicotine content on vape, and I've worked my way down. I'm at 8% now, nicotine content on the vape, and I'm slowly working my way down, but I'm not going to lie, when I quit smoking, I gained a lot of weight. I gained a shit ton of weight. Like 25 pounds. But no, I, under I understand that, Nicole. Like drinking drinking is, a, is another vice. But I'm sorry you had a stressful, stressful week at work. One more day. One more day. Friday, Friday is one, one day left. And he can now use the tidy tears ability. What is that? So there was the whole, um, of the storm. Until now, the use of this most ancient of magics was the sole privilege of the overseers of this world. Was it too much for you, perhaps? We granted you this privilege that you might finally dispose of the prophesied one. My apologies, your radiance. But the boy, he has a Unique power. Perhaps. Or perhaps you simply lack the power to stop him. Perhaps. Papers. Forgive me, your radiance. 
So is this her familiar? And it can the talk. The boy is clearly protected by the most potent of magics. Who could it be? The sage, Alicia. I had wondered your radiance. She who was foolish enough to stand against you. You think she troubles us even now, in the present? The power that protects him would suggest so. But he will need more than the sage's aid to save the world. He cannot succeed without the weapon of the ancients, the wand wrought by the wizard king. Mornstar. Indeed. But we have no cause to fear its power. He oh. will not find it. I have made that impossible. Making a wand disappear is the simplest of power tricks, after all. You mean to say you have rid us of Mornstar? I have. The most enduring symbol of the Wizard King's rule now drifts free of time and space. Mornstar. Fashioned in the image of our own council's wands and bestowed upon humanity. Yet now... I'm guessing she's the White Witch. You are certain the boy cannot possess it? Not now, nor for all eternity. Morstar. Do you think that the, uh... The Sage Alicia is why, uh... Is it Eve? I, I would beg that's a good... That's a good, uh, thought right there. Maybe the Eve girl that he keeps seeing is the Sage Alicia. Also, I have no, uh... Oh! You're coming after me! Let's see what you got, bro! I haven't had something come after me for a while. They must have some good shit. We're under attack. Ooh, I haven't seen those before. So that's a that's a that's a new thing. Zombo swing. I haven't seen one of those yet. We won. So there's at least three familiars that I have just found that I'm gonna have to grind to catch. I went to this island already and uh and caught some things. Ooh, four four from the I haven't seen a plessy yet. No, we just fought a plessy earlier. So I found an area that's got a couple a couple of ones I haven't caught yet. So that's cool. I know what I will be grinding off stream is trying to catch these fucking guys. I just want to be sure that this is the one we need to catch. 
Zom Boat Swain Ni no Kumi. Zomboat Swain, here we go. Evolves from Zombo. Yeah, so this is not one we're wanting to catch. Actually. Alright. Alright. This is not one. Oh, hold on. We gotta pull some people up on stream. Um, we're gonna pull up Dirty Durst. We're gonna pull up uh, Arctic Fire. We're gonna pull up Electric Jack. So I'm trying to only catch like the first forms of all of them. What can I say? It's a just because um. It's supposed to be... Blah, blah. Like you get all the abilities and and stats if you level them up yourself. So... That's what I'm trying to do here. It's interesting that they were introduced me to the second forms of them before I find the first forms. So then that means I must have missed something. What is this sparkly thing over here? Run away! Slumber now leaves, okay. I haven't seen this big tin man before. What is this big tin man? What is this big tin man? Well, this game is so long. Oh, no, it's super long. Oh, good. His name is Tin Man. Let's look him up. Tin Man. I'm basically like, these are people I'm gonna have to grind later. Yep, I need to catch a Tin Man. I need to catch a Tin Man. It's Big Well. Oh wow, the fucking, the Griffin fucking wiped him out. What's a big well? Is that a dumb question? It's not. It is not. Oh, we got a sprocket though. Hold on, I remember we needed a sprocket for something. We need it for this! Trophy! Pop fizz! Pop pop fizz fizz! Look at that. This is what old school Final Fantasies were like, Sally. Like, it was an open world, you ran around and kind of did whatever you want, and. Oh, we're gonna go fight a Tin Man! Oh, what a release it is. 
Oh, it's reduced damage. Uh, the new axe on our fucking thing. Catch him! Catch him, mate! I have at least five things to catch off stream now, so I got some grinding to do, so there's that. Oh! We caught a tin man! Big raw guy in the robots movie. Keep the Tin Man. We're gonna call him Timmy, I guess. All right, let's see what he does. Is he any good? Okay, so he's a tank. He's a tank. Well, we caught one. These are all things that I think I've already caught. I don't know what that is. What is this? I've never seen one of these. What is this? I must broaden my horizons. A clickety clank? I haven't seen a clickety clank before. Well, we didn't catch it. We didn't catch a clickety clank. these things either. What are these? Don't make things I know what you're talking about. Here goes nothing. Oh, it was a jack robot. We already have one of those. The only one I, I'm not sure about, I don't think we have, is the clickety plank. grind all this off stream. I'm not gonna bore people with it. I'm gonna continue on with the story. I think we're going on into this little pig fire pit. Yep, we're going to the pig fire pit. Alright, let's check this out. Palace of the Porcine Prince. Kind of looks like a pig. Is this me or a swain being a little strange these days? A lot of fun looking around. I'm off. Why did Jesus? I suppose he wants to be alone. Honestly, he does whatever he pleases. We'll have more fun without him, the soppy. Oh, well, that's that's fun. Okay, this guy's got some heart we can take. Uh, 
Oh, come on, come on. I'm... I got it, I got it. I got it. We must already have restraint. black truffle. I don't know what any of these things really do, so I'm just making sure I have at least one in my inventory. Oh, hold on, my fucking chat. He was played by Mel Brooks. I'll send it to you on Insta. Ooh. Alright, bear back. Gotta go grab a bevy. Get yourself a beverage. Grab a drink. Do -do -do. dude over here. Okay, so he wants a, a large mechanical creature, which we just got. He wants a, a cog. Um, what else? The only other mechanical creature I can have is a monolith. I need to catch the I need to catch the thing outside of the uh right outside of town. So I don't have one of those yet. Okay. So see now I got a shit ton of side quests to do, so I have stuff to grind off stream. Yeah, I haven't seen the game in a while, so let's go ahead and do that. Inside Mummy's tummy. More like inside Mummy's JJ. The music sounds very apprehensive. I guess we can't get over there until we get the approval of whoever the king is. Do you have new hunts for us? I'm basically picking up a lot of things and I'm going to grind off the stream so that I don't have to bore everybody. Yep. 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 
Yeah. Okay, so we got a lot of stuff to grind off stream now. Diagon. This makes makes me miss Di Diagon Alley at Universal Studios. Is that is this what it looks like? Is this the uh, Harry Potter world, Sally? Because I've never been. All right. Oh, oh, oh. yeah. Oh, we got a chest over here. A cup of strong coffee. Always good. Always good. Oh! Look at how expensive everything is. Too bad I can afford it. Ha ha. Ha ha. Cuz I have so much gold. Yes, equip this guy with it. And this is just fucking... Alright. Actually, dude, for how much gold I had, I'm actually... I'm spending a lot of fucking money right now to upgrade shit. Holy shit. Oh, look at this. Wow. So let's buy as many of these as we can. Yo, we just burned through all of our fucking money. I have 40,000. Kind of like the first proper level in Kingdom Hearts. Seems that way. You think she's done with you? But it's true. Welcome to Hog Heaven. Yes, we all know that happens. What happens when we go diagonally instead of Diagon? I don't know what happens. About the grace age you're all eager to find. Where is he? Uh, well, that's the thing. He's in the palace. The palace. See, everyone is forced to wear a pig mask. 
But without, well, they say there's a fellow who goes around without one. Apparently he calls himself the prince's servant. And his war, they say he's a young chap with long hair and fine features. So, okay, we're gonna have to go fucking do some more palace shit. Blah, 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 blah. Fucking, they find you for making eye contact? Did I not buy enough armor? I didn't buy enough armor for her, this fucking elephant. Let's go buy some armor real quick. I don't even have the money. Yeah, I can't buy anything else. I'm fucking done. Never mind. Never mind. I can't do anything. Of his kindness to give to other people because they're not kind. There's a guy over here. Wants to give her mother a flower for her birthday, but it doesn't look like it will blossom in time. So we're gonna go, we're gonna do quick and growth. What? We're gonna do as quick and growth, I think. What? Rejuvenate? What? Okay, well, it's a quest we picked up. We'll, we'll grind it out later. I think we can give this guy courage. Give heart. It's kind of like the... Courage. We can give him courage. So we just finished a fucking side quest. And most of the side quests so far have just been like, find this person. You know, like, blah, 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 blah. Find this fucking person and give them...
All right, let's go find out what the fucking king and or queen needs. Because we don't know yet. We don't want to impose gender roles. We wear disguises. Disguises. They want us to put on pig suits. We have to go to the black market to get them. Treasure chest. Treasure chest! Confusion be gone. Gonna do all this running back and forth just to fucking make somebody happy. Domain of the person. Pottered old corn, fresh black truffles. There's nothing, blah, blah, blah. He's a black market dealer. I got some stuff. I need some armor. Uh, I read very fast. The ends justifies means this isn't right, pretending to be who we aren't are. Thank you, mister. Now look at look, take a look at who you were is what your friend. Um wasn't that the thing? Sweet look. Come on, let's get changed. I feel very, I'm very big. I don't know how Oliver's walking around in this fucking suit of armor right now. It's twice his size. How is he controlling it? He did it in easy. All right, back to the palace. Oh, 
Oh, everybody else in town isn't following. Yeah, they don't follow you while they're in town. Interesting. Interesting! Ziggy's running to the bathroom. <laughs> He's so right. <laughs> He's like, oh my god, I gotta go. I gotta go. I'm not gonna make it. <laughs> Neato, we're in. All right, so we're gonna find out. You really know this stuff, Swain. Had nothing like it. Blah 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 blah. Um, what we've done for this far part of reading guards fine. No, I read terribly fast, guys. If you want me to stop and read shit out loud, please let me know, cause I will do so. Have you ever played the Sly Cooper games? I have. I have. I played some of the old ones for Nintendo. Was it Nintendo 64 or PS2? Oh god, we gotta get into this? Alright, we have to do like a whole fucking... The first three on PS2, I thought so. I played one on PS2 before. Uh, the last one was on PS3. I remember, I remember playing a couple on PS2. Alright, so what I'm going to do, I'm going to go ahead and save the game. Because I think I am done for the night. I'm about to run into this area. I think it's going to take me a very long time to finish. And then I'm going to grind the side quests and the catching of all the new things off stream. I don't want to bore you with that. So let's go here. We're going to rest. Save the game. Saying good night, everyone. Good night to all my dreams. Save our progress. All right. Figure that out. Okay, let's go to this screen. Hopefully, our, our new music kicks back in. Our new music. Come on. I'm waiting for it to kick in. I'm waiting for it to kick in. I don't know if it will. I don't know if it will. This is a new thing for me. I've tried it out. Doesn't look like it's gonna work. Oh well. Oh. Oh. There it goes. Anyway, like I said, I'm gonna have some new, I'm gonna have some new, uh, a whole new channel theme coming out soon. I hope to have it finished by Monday. Um, I'll keep y'all posted when it does. Um, tomorrow night, I'll be back. I'm playing some Nautica. And I think, because I've been looking at the, the, the trophies from where we're at, I think I'm at a spot where I think we might might. We might finish with Subnautica tomorrow night. It's a, that's a big if, but I, I think we can. I think we're going to not only 
finish it, but we're gonna 100% it and get our platinum trophy without cheating. This is what a lot of people suggested. So I think we're I think we're close to that. Then Saturday, I don't know what we're playing yet. Saturday, Saturday is kind of my up in the up in the air day. We're gonna play kind of whatever I'm feeling. But I'm not going to lie, I might be playing some Avengers on Saturday. Just because next next week, or the next week and a half, um, some the Black Panther expansion is coming out. So I'm going to knock some rust off. I'm going to run some missions as Thor. Uh, probably play around with that. Um, I'm hoping, if we can get some time... Um, Sally and I can play that because now that uh, Sally, I forgot to tell you that those um, Mega Hive missions, the one where you get all the good gear from, that we had to do by ourselves, we don't have to do by ourselves anymore. So that would be cool if we could we could run that sometime. Um, up to you. I know you're a you're a busy lady. Um. Other than that, Sunday night, movie night, I haven't quite decided yet, but I'm almost 100% positive we'll be doing Alien. Almost positive. I just haven't checked to see if there's anything new that came out or that's on Prime that maybe may or may not be better. Um, I haven't checked. I haven't decided yet. Um, probably, we'll probably do an Alien on Sunday night. Um, other than that, I'll see you guys tomorrow night. I'll be streaming tomorrow night at 7.30. Sally's streaming tomorrow night, too, so come, come hang out with her. Um, I love y'all. Peace.